a message from Brother Salim Hakeem. In the mornings, when the sun rises, nothing else matters. Not the matter in the world, not the scatter of a girl, not the blatter of an earl. See, Earl once was a king of the east side, but Earl snitched on Cheryl because Cheryl was fucking with Daryl and Daryl didn't know his girl was burning. Food, that is. She was burning the food for the youth who didn't have a group of people to see. Oh, brother, 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 you have to understand. You have to understand to overstand the situation, which is instigation, revitalization, and a patient that just got discharged. He who discharges should get looked at by Dr. J, who slammed once on a court of law that he who eats Swiss rolls, he's not necessarily Swiss, he just enjoys the rolls. Oh, brother, brother. See, in Sweden, there are no such thing as Swedish fish. That is a word adopted by the arrogance of the American man. There's no sweetest fish. In fact, in France, there's no such thing as French toast. It's just toast. There is no host. Or the most you can bring from Africa, the motherland, the brotherland, or as I like to call it, home. When you eternalize and revitalize, eventually you will conjugize and realize that you are the master of your trait. Oh, brother, don't make me get deep. See, if you can master the gates when you're running from the police, you can just jump and escape. Oh, brother. See, if you don't gain the knowledge provided by the incarnated college, you will soon realize that you ain't got it. Oh, brother, oh, brother. See, when she bends over and you're behind, if you don't get hard, you got a problem. Because eventually that sister will tell her sister that this nigga couldn't perform under the pressures of a stank booty. Oh, brother. See, when the, when, the, when the booty stinks, it's up to you, brother, to make a choice. Will you leave or will you close them cheeks and proceed to indignitize your penile glands inside of her vaginal region? Just hope she doesn't have any secretion. But I once knew a girl named Elisa who didn't believe a nigga had a condom on. You see, when you are ready, you don't have to get ready. I walk around with a condom on just in case she wants to take me in the bathroom to the sink not for a drink, but for a smell 
of that pink. That's today's lesson from Salim, Hakeem, Hashim, the beat, Alajuwan, Farrakhan, the third. Peace be unto you, my sisters, my brothers, and white people.